Hi guys, welcome back. So today I've got a new build order for you. This is a, a new you put in build order. So if you've seen uh, T90's latest video, he's got a new strategy has Mr. You put in, and it's involving the Romans. So it's a Romans fast castle into a double siege workshop scorpions. <laughs> so um, and when I say fast castle, it's ridiculously fast. We're looking at 12 minutes. Well, in T90's video, he does it at 12:30. This one's 12.20, uh, it's a little bit more refined. Um, so what we're doing is you're sending your first four villagers onto sheep, the next one that comes out lures a boar, uh, and then you're adding another two onto boar slash sheep. So you're gonna have um, seven in total on the food under the town center at this point. Uh, but yeah, it's an absolutely ridiculous strategy. Uh, 12 minutes and 20 seconds, or well, 21 seconds, or, uh, generally what I, can achieve with it a little bit of idle time here and there uh, but it's just absolutely crazy absolutely crazy so um i think i've not actually looked at what how you put in does it i just saw the time uh, that it goes for uh realize there's quite a lot of idle time in this build uh, probably you know 25 seconds worth and i thought you know you could actually refine this build order and get that extra villager and still achieve the same castle time so that's what i did so um, next three villages are going over to wood. We're going to build a house as well as a lumber camp. And we're going to be pushing all our deer in as well uh, from this point. So, um, next thing we're going to be doing is adding another two villages onto boar slash deer. And we're going to lure the second boar with an existing villager. Uh, so we're actually going to be clicking up with uh, 20 population, but no loom. So it's going to be extremely fast. It's going to be the uh, same sort of timings as a normal 19 pop uh, feudal age, if you're doing 19 pop with loom. So it's ridiculously fast. Okay, so now we've got our two on boar. We're actually going to send five more villagers over to berries. So we need five on berries because we need to get that extra food from the berries. So that's what we're going to be going for. So if you've not got the five on berries, uh, you won't have enough uh, food to click up. So I think uh, you put in, ends up having to sell a little bit of wood, um, you know, and buying some food to click up. This way, uh, you don't need to buy any food. You should have just enough um, to click up to the castle age. And all you need to do is sell 200 stone for the gold. So um, I'm going to fast forward a little bit. Just till we've got those um, five on the berries there. And then the final thing you need to do is just add two villagers onto wood. So it'll give you a total of five on wood. And you'll find you might just need to quickly garrison. I didn't quite need to there, but um, yeah, you might need to just quickly garrison those villagers under the TC. And at this point, it's just take all the sheep. Uh, you've not actually got to do anything, any moving around at this point. Just keep them going. So I'm just going to speed up. There's nothing to build. Just get those sheep. Um, you might want to make a few little walls around your berries, perhaps just to keep them protected. But as soon as you hit the food age, take three villages to make the um, market. So that will just ensure that the market is up in time, uh, ready to click up. One to make the uh, blacksmith. And you can send your first villager onto the sheep just to help finish your sheep off and then finish off with a loom. And as you can see, we're just about ready. Again, you might just need to quickly garrison the villagers there. And then we've clicked up straight away. Perfect. Almost perfect timing. Um, so we're going to send five of those villagers from uh, sheep onto straggler trees or just get them on wood and uh, five onto gold. So I've actually taken a couple off there, uh, straggler trees and send them to the main wood line, or one of them anyway. Um, and then probably when you're about 50% up to castle age, you, you can do it a little bit sooner if you want, take a couple of villages off of uh, berries and, and try and sneak them forward towards the enemy base. So don't go to the front, perhaps go around the side or something. Um, get double bit axe on the way up, that's just come in now. But yeah, if you can kind of sneak them in, uh, around the side you should be you should be absolutely fine uh, for that I forgot to move the build order app but there's the there's a, well, there's a bit of a coding error there but uh, make a blacksmith in the market want to shoot bloom sell 200 gold uh, stone click up
and then we're on this bit. So um, we're just sending those two from various forward now, uh, and you'll see Castellage is going to come in soon, and we're at 11.40, so we've got about another sort of 30 seconds or so to go. So we'll just go forward, and you can see we're just about to hit Castellage. Boom, 12.23. Uh, and we're going to make two siege workshops straight away. I do actually lose these two villages, which is a bit annoying. Uh, scouts get me. So you might just want to make sure you, you're walling these villages in. So learn from my mistakes here. Uh, but we did actually have enough food to still make some villages, because obviously we've got these on the farms. I'm just sending them over to gold. It just helps me to you know, get my gold up a little bit so I can buy and sell. Um, well, more, more so buying. Uh, stone really um, wood sorry there you go I'm just going to lose those two villages but at this point it's just a case of spam your scorpions from here so I'm just going to let them build up a bit and then I'll inject them there we go and start attacking um, you could probably get away with just doing perhaps three and kicking them out to uh, start taking down those scouts but um, once you've got a few get a ram so perhaps once you've got like six or seven, get a ram and start going in and, and taking down the enemy buildings. If you've got, um, if you can take out their production buildings, military production buildings, uh, and eventually just move into the town centre. Uh, I've not really gone the, the best way around it for damaging those things. I've got, gone a good way for taking out the eco mind, um, but not necessarily buildings. So this ram I'm not really doing much with it in a minute, but just keep on spamming these uh, scorpions out. Use your market, buy some wood. Spam some scorpions. And that's essentially all there is to this build order. So let me know what you think in the comments for this one. Um, I've actually been able to do the Lancer Rush at a very similar time. And it's getting me, it's making me think can I do something like this with Tatars for um, Cav Archer Rush? So like 12 minute Cav Archer Rush or something along those sorts of lines. If those villagers are still alive, I'd have them here to repair uh, the, the ram. But as you can see, it's just pure chaos. Cheers, guys. See you on the next one.